A Minnesota teenager says that her private joke should never have made the school yearbook. I did not mean for it to get into the yearbook, and I did not mean for it to blow up, and I certainly did not mean it in any threatening manner whatsoever. 15-year-old Cameron went to Brainerd High School last year. When the yearbook came out this week, she was quoted on a page about President Donald Trump. The quote said, I would like to behead him. I do not like him. Cameron reached out to WCCO tonight to explain what happened and why she's now scared for her safety. I was so confused because at first, I didn't remember ever saying that. 15-year-old Cameron says she had no idea a conversation with a classmate last September would lead to nationwide attention. She says a classmate never said she was working for the yearbook when she asked about then-candidate Donald Trump. I did not say, I want to behead him. I did not say, I'm going to behead him. I just said, well, I'm sure we all wouldn't mind him being beheaded. Something along those lines, but there was never the direct quote, I do not like him. I would like to behead him. Eight months later, that conversation exploded on social media with the help of at least one celebrity. This just all blew up, and Scott Baio, uh, as you know, a very famous actor, um, posted it on Twitter, and he didn't cover my name or picture either. And his over 100,000 Twitter followers all got my first and last name and my picture. The Secret Service said today that it's investigating. Cameron hasn't heard from them, but says she reached out today. I wanted to make sure that there was you know, no way that they would, you know, beat down my front door and get me in handcuffs because I didn't say that. The school district says it was previously unaware of the yearbook comments and is investigating how this happened. In a statement, the district said it does not support or otherwise endorse any disrespectful or politically based statements that are in the yearbook and apologizes for the statements that were included. Cameron says she's been most scared by the reaction from adults. Not even one student has given me backlash. All adults have said the most terrible, nasty things to me on social media, and it's terrifying. Cameron no longer goes to Brainerd High School. She told us that she has deactivated her Facebook page and all her other social media accounts are private.